Oh, WWE Universe! Don't you dare be sour! Clap for your longest reigning tag champs and feel the power! The following eight-man contest is a battle royale. Making his way to the ring from Atlanta, Georgia, weighing in at 205 pounds, Xavier Woods. It's a new day, Byron. Oh, yes, it is. Also, guys, I would say that competing on Christmas has to be a tremendous thrill. I can't speak for what it's like to be in the ring, but I can tell you it's an absolute blast to be here at ringside on such a special evening. Weighing in at 275 pounds, the Ultimate Warrior! Ah, oh, the energy inside the arena has just picked up. It's hard not to get excited when you hear the Ultimate Warrior's music. And before we go any further, I'd like to extend a very Merry Christmas to our WWE Universe watching at home. Ah, uh, I echo those sentiments, Michael. And I hope that Santa was good to everybody out there. Even you, Corey. I hope he brings you coal, Byron. Chicago, Illinois, weighing in at 215 pounds, Aiden English. Guys, this match is sure to not disappoint, especially considering who's involved here tonight. You're absolutely right, Michael. This match will be one we'll be talking about for a long time to come. And guys, I hope Santa was good to you this morning. Oh, he's always good to me, Cole. Though, I'm pretty sure Saxton ended up with Cole in his stocking. Calgary, Alberta, Canada, weighing in at 204 pounds, Tyson Kidd. Byron, as we get started here, tell me what's the best approach to take in a battle royal. Well, the first thing I would do is make some alliances and go after the biggest competitor. From there, I'd stay as far away from the ropes as possible. That's where all the trouble goes down. Also, guys, I would say that competing on Christmas has to be a tremendous thrill. I can't speak for what it's like to be in the ring, but I can tell you it's an absolute blast to be here at ringside on such a special evening.
Weighing in at 238 pounds, Jinder Mahal. And here comes Jinder Mahal. Love him or hate him, Cole, you have to respect Jinder Mahal's climb to the top of the WWE roster. And before we go any further, I'd like to extend a very Merry Christmas to our WWE Universe watching at home. Uh, I echo those sentiments, Michael, and I hope that Santa was good to everybody out there. Even you, Corey. I hope he brings you coal, Byron. Pennsylvania, weighing in at 237 pounds, Kurt Angle. Guys, you have to think that this battle royal will be one for the ages. Truer words may never have been spoken, Michael. This battle royal has all the elements of an instant classic. Also, guys, I would say that competing on Christmas has to be a tremendous thrill. I can't speak for what it's like to be in the ring, but I can tell you it's an absolute blast to be here at ringside on such a special evening. From Kill Devil Hill, North Carolina, weighing in at 223 pounds, Scott Dawson! A big time battle royal here, guys. Who do you like in this one, Byron? Well, historically, you're safest when you put your money on the biggest superstar. But to be honest, I'm not sure. I can see any one of these competitors walking away with a win. And before I forget, allow me to wish everybody out there a very Merry Christmas. You know, I can't help but wonder what I did wrong to have to be spending Christmas sitting next to you two. From Stone Mountain, Georgia, weighing in at 241 pounds, Apollo Crews. Apollo Crews looking as determined as ever here tonight. Yeah, but determination can only get you so far, Cole. Apollo Crews better have brought his A game, too. And guys, I hope Santa was good to you this morning. Oh, he's always good to me, Cole. Though, I'm pretty sure Saxton ended up with Cole in his stocking. All right, it's time to kick this thing off. And here we go, guys, as this match gets underway here in the shadows of the famed Hart Mansion.
and the strike connects. Aiden English is looking to end this. Ooh, the elbow lands. That one fails to connect. Great idea by him. Too bad it was awfully executed, though. Give us your thoughts about Aiden English. It'll be interesting to see how he plans to get it done. What do you think? One of the reasons a battle royal is so dangerous is because there's nothing you can do to prepare for it. It can have a different amount of participants, different rules about a tire and what's at stake. He needs to be at his absolute best. He really needs to lay low and save his strength if he wants to be around when it counts. Plenty of force behind that shot. Scott Dawson is a force within the ring. Ultimate Warrior in a little bit of trouble here. He came into this match expecting a fight, and that's exactly what he's getting. I know it's somewhat early still, but this could be a pivotal point in this match, guys. Let's see how he reacts here. It's got Dawson on the defensive now. He's going to have to cut off his opponent's offense quickly. The good news for him is that he doesn't appear to have taken too much offense up to this point, but that can obviously all change here. Oh, and he reverses it. Apollo unleashing an all-out assault. Few superstars are as dominant as this guy. When this guy's on, look out. Oh, what impact. Oh, Aiden English saw that one coming. Who's able to avoid damage there? Ultimate Warrior finds a way out. He's sending a message to the entire WWE locker room here. Just toying with the competition a little. No reverses it. Nice job by Tyson Kidd. Ultimate Warrior gets out of trouble quickly. Knocked the breath out with a crushing kick to the gut. Let's hope, for his sake, that he can keep performing at this level. It's a tall order. And he hits the knee lift. Flips the script on him there. How do you think Ultimate Warrior could unleash substantial punishment right now? His hopes of winning this match appear to be dwindling in a hurry. Yeah, he's operating at a level few can match right now. He delivers a hard clothesline. Ultimate Warrior finds a way out. Lets him up. What incredible power from the Warrior. Gorilla Press Slam. Talk about taking care of business. You better hope this stamina holds up. Oh, the reversal by Apollo Crews. He's too quick for him there. And there's his speed paying off. A piercing strike. Ultimate Warrior looking a little uneasy. It appears his opponent has his number right now. He's not looking like himself right now, and I hate to say it, but this might be the beginning of the end for him here. He gets him with a reversal. Down he goes. That'll do it every time. It's a tough spot to find yourself in, that's for sure. But if anybody could break free from this, it's this superstar right here. Tyson Kidd showing us how to get it done. He's really taking over this match now. He misses the dive. And unfortunately for him, there was no water in the pool. Oh, he's able to reverse it. by Tyson Kidd. The strikes have a little extra on them tonight. Ultimate Warrior is getting a serious beatdown. Not sure how much more anyone would be able to take. His outlook is not good at all. 
Let's not write him off yet. Remember, his opponent isn't necessarily whistling Dixie either. He's going for it all. This might be the end of the road for him, Byron. Well, if he can't get back to his feet, you're absolutely right. Here he goes. Ultimate Warrior gets out of trouble quickly. He's fighting back here. I expected nothing less, Cole. Ultimate Warrior finds a way out. He clearly did his homework heading into tonight. Not every move is designed to get the fans off their feet. Tyson Kidd gives these fans all they could want and more. If he sticks this, he is done. Look at this. He knows he's in trouble. Look, Tyson Kidd. He looks like he's got this. There's a fisherman's neck breaker. Just when you thought he had nothing left. But now, can Tyson Kidd capitalize on this? He may be in the best physical condition I've ever seen him in. Not today. He doesn't appear to be in a hurry to get up here. I just don't think he has it in him anymore. Flattens him with a clothesline. Oh my God, he's done it. He scored the win. Here is your winner, the Ultimate Warrior. What a grueling victory here in this elimination match. To be the last one standing after such a grueling encounter is beyond amazing, Michael. What a match, and a quick thank you to everybody for spending part of their Christmas with us here at the WWE.